is the winter of our discontent, made glorious summer by the sun of York, and all the clouds that lowered upon our house in the deep bosom of the ocean buried. Now are our brows bound with victorious wreaths, our bruised arms hung up for monuments, our stern alarms changed to merry meetings, <coughs> our dreadful marches to delightful measures. Grim-visaged war had smoothed his wrinkled front, and now, instead of mounting barbed steeds, to fright the souls of fearful adversaries, he capers nimbly in the lady's chamber to the lascivious pleasing of a lute. Now this nasty, heavy, week-long winter is at an end. The Berlin street cleaning, just call her BSR, was indisposed, disabled and without any chance. Weather is called a noticeable set of all the phenomena occurring in a given atmosphere at a given time. Recently there only occurred snow, beastly cold and fucking rain. Not shaped for sportive tricks, nor made to court an amorous looking glass. I, that am rudely stamped and want love's majesty to strut before a wanton emblem. I, that am curtailed of this fair proportion, cheated of feature by dissembling nature, deformed, unfinished, sent before my time into this breathing world, scarce half made up, and that so lamely and unfashionable, that dogs bark at me as I held by them. Our country is not all set for spring. The dream couple of German politics is in conflict permanently. Guido, the preacher of hate, contaminates the air. To breath is only allowed for people that work. The Catholic guru Bishop Mixer muscles in a little and thinks that freedom, love, happiness and all the long-haired guys are guilty of priests that always want to fuck. But whether Morley, the celibacy damaged men or rather the unestablished fuckers tend to rape their students stays without any question. And meanwhile the evangelical super lady bishop goes through the lights on red while being pissed drunk. Cheers, here we go. <coughs> Why I? in this weak piping time of peace, have no delight to pass away the time unless to see my shadow in the sun, and decent on mine own deformity, and therefore, since I cannot prove a lover to entertain these fair well-spoken days, I am determined to prove a villain and hate the idle pleasures of these days. we supposed to do? The criticism of the system becomes more and more dull and difficult. The more we chafe at, the more we sink in this juggernaut that is somehow called market economy, capitalism, democracy or however anyway. When we start to analyze all these empty, dashed off non-words of the party politicians, fair, equitable, free, and so on, then we act as if they had really said something, isn't it? Why this it is when men are ruled by women? We are the Queen's abjects and must obey. Brother, farewell. I will unto the King. And whatsoever you will employ me in, were it to call King Edward's widow sister, I will perform it to enfranchise you. Meantime, 
This deep disgrace in brotherhood touches me deeper than you can imagine. Never let it be said this past fucking coldness does not match with this highly charged atmosphere in which the social camps are stirred up hatred against each other in these days. But now the clash of different visions of life starts. Well, your imprisonment shall not be long. I will deliver you or else lie for you. Meantime, have patience.